Days like today when there's lingering snow on the roads, we all need to be extra careful. But in the western suburbs, we found dozens of accidents in just one year at the corner of Route 31 and Fabian Parkway. So the Morning Insiders decided to take a look at why and what can be done to make it safer. There was an oncoming car that was turning left. I just saw a car coming at us. He's like not stopping and he's turning into us. I heard my mom screaming and then we got hit. We ended up flipping over three times. My friends started crying. Um, it, was, it was scary. The Toman family vividly recalls their 2015 crash at the intersection of Route 31 and Fabian Parkway in Batavia. It was kind of surreal. It felt like slow motion. There's a lot of them. Their family never made it to their destination. Luckily, the van was the only casualty, at least physically. I do know my wife doesn't go, <laughs> she doesn't go that way anymore. Local Facebook groups are filled with posts about the road design. That intersection is so dangerous. Something bad always happens there. We obtained reports about the dangers at Route 31 and Fabian Parkway and discovered 100 crashes over the last five years. 25 last year alone, about half occur while making left turns. We do a lot of traffic enforcement in that area. The Batavia Police Department has a front row seat to these crashes. It's the way the intersection is set up. There's a curve in the road. If you're driving west on Fabian and want to go straight, you actually have to veer to the right. If you continue straight, you're going to hit the car sitting in the left lane. Of the left turn crashes we examine, the vast majority look like this, all because of that confusing design. But what's the solution? All four lanes, when you're turning left, it, it should be an arrow only. A sentiment echoed on social media, but the Kane County Department of Transportation says not so fast. If we were to operate the traffic signals as protected only, the left turning traffic would frequently back up into the through lanes, effectively reducing Fabian Parkway to a single through lane. And there's been one fatality at the intersection in five years. Kane County says it continues to consider options for the intersection and has recently imp implemented lane striping extensions for left turns. There are also long term projects underway involving signs and traffic signals to help.